so I woke up super early this morning and had to go to, look at this nice tree. So I woke up super early this morning and went to the dentist first thing at 7 a.m. Now my teeth are nice and bright and clean again. Of course, it is louder than heck here in New York City, but travel down Park Avenue and also this is Grand Central Station here. It's a beautiful day today, although chilly, and I think this is a day before it dumps a ton of snow on the city, which is supposed to happen tomorrow. But the good news is it's 7 a.m. now. I'm done with my dentist appointment. The bad news is I have a cavity, and I haven't had a cavity in like 10 years. I've had one in my life. This is the second cavity I've had in my entire life. It's not really a cavity. It's like almost a cavity or like a very mild one, but we're gonna go ahead and get it filled tomorrow anyways. So I'm gonna head back here tomorrow to the same dental office and get it filled. I mean, it's so loud. This is where all the construction's happening. So anyways, I'm heading back up to my apartment now and uh, I'll tell you what we're doing today. big cause doll I found here. That's pretty cool. For those of you who know what cause is, they make these dolls. This is, I think this artist that makes these dolls. Pretty cool. This one's like probably 15 feet high. All right, so I just got home from the dentist. I don't even know if you guys could hear me when I was out there on Park Avenue because it was so loud outside with all the construction going on. Like the city literally just woke up as I was leaving the dental office. So that's why it's a little loud. But I did see that cool Kaws, K-A-W-S doll uh, outside, which is pretty cool. It was like 15 feet high at least. Um, I couldn't go in to see it, but what can you do? Um, anyway, so I went to the dentist this morning. Everything was good. Have a questionable cavity um, that I'm just gonna go ahead and get filled tomorrow per what my dentist was saying which is way better than waiting and then getting worse and getting a root canal and all that stuff. But uh, shout out to Tend, Tend Dental. If you're ever in New York City, I think they're just based in New York City, but that place is flawless. This is not sponsored by the way, but that is like the way dental offices should be run. I know the title of this video is something like, I hate doing this or some clickbaity title, but the reason I want to do this is because I absolutely hate going to the dentist. And I know I'm not alone in this. I think everybody probably hates going to the dentist, but I really hate it. I don't know why. It's not like it's painful. It's not annoying. It's just like, I hate having them like drill way in my teeth and then my mouth gets tired and all that stuff. But I basically just complain a lot. And then Andrano was booking an appointment and I wasn't going to be outdone, so I booked an appointment. And I like to go first thing in the morning before I have anything to eat or drink because my mouth is usually fresh and we get a nice cleaning. But now I feel bad for getting this for multiple reasons because one, I went against my morning coffee that I usually make for myself, but Andrana already made some this morning and I knew the pot was gonna be old by the time I got here and I didn't feel like making more. So I went and got a fresh, $1.30 cup of coffee at the place right outside my apartment, which is arguably the best coffee in all of New York City. I'm not even lying. This coffee is so good. And I'm drinking with a metal straw because, you know, just got these fresh white teeth polished and I don't want to ruin them already. So it is a beautiful cold day today. Uh, I pretty much am just going to do like a little vlog style thing today because I thought about doing the whole Vlogmas vlog every single day like almost every YouTuber is doing, but then I realized I'm a YouTuber, but I'm also a doctor and I'm in my fellowship, which is very difficult to film every single day, as you all know. So I just can't make that work. But what I will do is throw in a few of these vlogs uh, while I'm just kind of like out and about. And also one thing I haven't mentioned yet is that I'm actually on vacation right now, which means I have the next seven days off 
and this is day two. It is now Tuesday, by the way. It's Tuesday morning at 9 a.m. Day two of vacation and got the dentist all ready to go. Going to start looking for jobs again today. Going to work out this morning and go from there. So I was about to make myself some breakfast, but then when I came back in after getting coffee, my apartment building had this huge display of bagels and cream cheese. So obviously I had to get that. I'm gonna eat that now and then go work out in a little bit and uh, go from there. This is all my uh, toothbrush supplies over here. I uh, just finished eating breakfast and looked for jobs and I was pretty unsuccessful. So yeah, um, sorry, I didn't just finish eating breakfast. I finished eating lunch, I ate breakfast a while ago. Looked for jobs for a little bit, failed miserably and ate some lunch. And does anybody feel like they like cheat on their dentist after they eat their first meal of the day after going to the dentist? Cause that's how I feel right now. Like I just went to the bathroom to floss because I feel like I like did my dentist wrong now. Like I shouldn't be eating ever after going to the dentist. But anyways, I'm finally going to get to the gym now. Uh, it's a little later, like almost 2 p.m. right now. And I was trying to go to work out around 11 a.m. but failed miserably for the second time today. Um, so yeah, going to the gym now. And it's been a while, so hopefully I don't pass out from being out of shape. Just worked out. Whew. I'm a little on the tired side. I hate wearing these masks while I work out. It like drives me crazy because then my face just gets super sweaty and I get really hot, especially when I'm on like the treadmill or whatnot. But um, yeah, anyways, gonna shower, probably work on editing a video and uh, getting some sponsors done and all that stuff. And take a shower and maybe I'll walk to see Andriana. And uh, we'll go from there. All right, so it is super dark outside. Meanwhile, it's only 5.40 p.m. right now. I was just doing some stuff, showered, and basically was browsing YouTube and all that stuff. But I just want to show you all, we just decorated the house with Christmas stuff. And I'm about to go leave to get Indiana at work right now. I don't know, I have nothing else to do. Might as well get some exercise. It's freezing outside. And I like being out when it's really cold outside, so I'm gonna go get her. But I wanted to show you our apartment because I'm going to turn on the Christmas tree and the lights around here before she gets home because she like literally loves this stuff. It like puts her in a good mood as soon as she walks the door and sees a Christmas tree. So I'll show you. So this is our lovely Christmas tree. Then we just put some random lights around the uh, big window here. And the apartment tour probably won't come for a little bit of time because we still have a few more things to do here and you know, we're just not ready for it. It'll come though, so many people ask for it. All right, so I don't know why I didn't think of this before, but I know I have a flash on my camera I can just turn the light on when it's dark outside because I was having trouble filming out here. But nonetheless, I'm going to pick up Andrana right now. And you know, I'm a little sad because I already feel bad for these restaurateurs where they like, you know, have no indoor dining. They can't have any outdoor dining now because the uh, mayor just shut it down. So they relied 100% on their outdoor dining and now they can't even do that. And the reason they shut down the outdoor dining now is because there is a snowstorm coming in tomorrow afternoon, which is going to dump like five to 12 inches or so on the ground. And that is why outdoor dining is shut down. So you really can't win if you're a restaurateur in New York City right now, which is why so many restaurants are shutting down at the current time. And uh, yeah, so it's unfortunate times. I just want everybody to see what my wife is wearing when it's 32 degrees outside. Look at what she's wearing. She's, she's frozen over here. Are you frozen? 
frozen. <laughs> so look how pretty this street is. <laughs> this is the prettiest street in all of Manhattan right now. Beautiful. And the package has been secured and we are going home for the night after a long <laughs> day. We both went to the dentist today, by the way. I have a cavity, she doesn't. So I have to go back tomorrow, but this day is officially over. All right, we are back at home now. Andrana is safe and sound, even though she's not in the frame right now. But I realized I forgot to end the vlog when I was outside and freezing. So I'll go ahead and end it here. Hope you all enjoyed today's vlog. As always, make sure you smash that like, subscribe, and follow me on Instagram and TikTok if you don't already. Otherwise, I'll see you on the next video. Peace.